the first thing you should always do is turn off the power at the circuit breaker. All right, now once you've turned off the circuit breaker, what we can do then is take our screwdriver and we take out the faceplate. So there's two black wires and you need to go ahead and get your screwdriver and unscrew uh, these two screws. All right, so you get your screwdriver and remove these screws. Okay, so you, this is the switch and you get this wire and hook it to this screw and this wire down here you put it to this screw. If you have a copper ground wire, make sure the copper ground wire connects to the green ground screw. Okay, now once all your wires are securely attached, you are ready to reattach your switch. If you have these wire nuts, it's a good idea to cover it with black electrical tape for safety reasons. Okay, once you've done that, you can go ahead and maneuver the wires and attach the box. Okay, now that your switch is securely fastened, you can go ahead and reattach the faceplate. Yeah, how you done?